Mikey, we are ready to start the experiment. Oh! Now we will stay only the last steps on the adjustment of all the equipment. JJ, are you sure that everything will go according to plan? Suddenly there will be some mistake that will lead us to terrible consequences. Of course it will. I spent a lot of time on all calculations. There will be no mistakes. We will be able to create a real zombie girl. Woohoo! I'm almost done. When I tell you to pull the lever, push it. Yep. I have to check all in the last time. I hope everything goes according to plan. It's all right then. Done. Mikey, pull the lever. <laughs> yeah, we did it. Just like I thought, we created Zombie Girl. Excellent work, JJ. You have done very well. And all the time you spent on calculations has not been wasted. We have achieved results. What do we do next? Hmm. Watch her. What? She broke the glass. Looks like she's smarter than a normal zombie. I'll have to write it down, but she can get out now. We must run away from here, JJ. She can bite us. We can't do anything here. We need to hide in our homes. You're right, Mikey. Unfortunately, we can't stop her. She's getting stronger and stronger by the minute. I didn't know that. I hope everything will be all right. Maybe she'll just leave town now and never come back? I don't know. Maybe now the zombie girl apocalypse is about to begin. Hmm. Huh? What is it? Why is it following me? No, I have to get out of here. No! What's going on out there? I heard someone scream. Oh my god, what's that? What's that green flying thing? Why is it following me? No! Zombie girl released the flying infection. It flies, chases villagers, and turns them into the same zombie girls. Mikey and JJ have created an apocalypse. What will they do now? How will they cope with it? Soon we will know. It's time to have a nice bite. I'll go and check out our lab after the meal. <laughs> huh? Mikey? Hey, what are you doing here? JJ, we started the apocalypse. What? The zombie girl did something and turned our whole village into just like her. Mikey, turn around. A bunch of zombie girls came running to our house. Did you bring them here? No, I tried to run to you unnoticed. Looks like they smelled us. My God, what do we do? They'll bite us now and we'll turn into zombie girls too. <gasps> Look, Mikey, that's our dog. Come on, Mikey, get in there. Woohoo! Great, now it's my turn. Woohoo! Yeah, Mikey, we got it. The dog can run from these zombie girls faster than us, and we can start figuring out a way to stop this apocalypse. You're right, JJ. Let's go deeper and see what's in our dog. Maybe we can improve it or build something inside it. We're gonna have to build a station where we're gonna make a cure for this virus. Hmm, you see that too? Some green flying thing. I don't think it should be in our dog. Let's deal with it. Maybe this thing is going to turn our dog into a zombie girl. Let's go, Mikey, but be careful. Don't squeeze, JJ. I won't stick my neck out. I'll watch you carefully. I don't want to become a zombie girl either. If I turn to zombie, who's going to help you with the cure? <laughs> You're right. Okay, now I'm going to quickly deal with this strange thing and we will decide what to do next. Great, I can beat her. You see, when we hit it, she gets smaller. Just a few more strokes and she'll disappear completely. Woohoo! Great, we have dealt with this problem. Now we can think about other problems. First, we need to get our dog to safety. Come on, Mikey. We have to control this dog and go to a house where zombie girls won't find us. You're right, JJ. Go then to our dog's brain and there we can get it under control. We have to get her out of our house before too many zombies come and attack our dog. Hmm. Yes, Mikey. Now we will connect to the brain of our dog and run away from our house. Be ready. Now we will be shaken inside the dog. I suggest you grab something so you don't fall and hurt yourself. Great, I'm controlling a dog. These zombie girls don't seem to know where we've gone. I will not draw too much attention and will try to just leave the house quietly. There's someone coming. Looks like another zombie girl. But what is she doing here? Another one. They're getting bigger and bigger. This is my chance to run away from this house. My God, they're everywhere. There are even a lot of them on the street. One of them even hangs on the roof. What a horror. They really infected the whole village. We'll have to do something about it. We'll have to come up with a cure that can cure them and turn them back into normal people. Hmm, even here they are. They control absolutely the whole village. 
They seem to know that there are still two people alive and they're trying to find us. We're almost at the new house. Uh-oh. Huh? Sorry, Mikey. I didn't know there was a trap. We need to get out of it before the zombie girls come to us. Keep the ender pearls. Put them on your eyes and our dog will be able to teleport to wherever it looks. <laughs> Great idea, Mikey. We're lucky that you decided to take an ender pearls with you. I don't know what we would do if you didn't take them with you. Okay, now the next task. Our dog injured her legs after the fall. I have to cure her. Hmm, you can use blocks for this. Do you have iron blocks? Yep. Great. I'm using them to repair and fortify the bones in our dog's legs. Great, good luck. I'll wait for you here. Okay, Mikey. Now I have to find a leg that broke and start treating it. It's like this leg is injured. Hmm, yes, it will not be the easiest task, but I think I can still do it. Get on while I do this, zombie girls will not find our dog. Hmm, who built this trap? Failed zombie girls so clever that even know how to build traps? This is very interesting. The experiment was successful, but I had to think about safety and at least put in a glass that my hands couldn't possibly break. Okay, now our job is to figure out a way to fix my mistake and cure all the villagers. I have almost finished building this leg. It remains only to break the remaining blocks. Great, I have just restored the dog's leg. She can walk again. We must quickly get out of this pit and run to the laboratory. Hmm. Wow, we have an ender pearls instead of eyes. We have to try using a teleport. It was cool. Now we can move safely around the village and not be afraid of zombie girls. We need to get to our lab and start thinking up a way to save the villagers. Hmm. Where have all the zombie girls gone? Have they escaped from the village? Hmm. Perhaps they are looking for us somewhere else. Either way, it's good for us and we can safely get to our lab and start practicing the cure. We need to lock all the doors just in case and come down. Now I'm gonna come up with a way to cure all the zombie girls at once. It's gonna be hard, but I think I can do it. Don't worry, JJ, I'll help you. I already have some ideas. Maybe they will work. While JJ and Mikey create a cure for zombie girls, these zombie girls have already gathered at their house and are going to destroy it. They put TNT around their whole house. JJ and Mikey are now so busy creating the drug that they don't even hear the sound. This explosion will be a huge surprise to them because they thought all the zombie girls ran away from the village. But in fact, they just hid and looked for TNT. Zombie Girl is almost done with TNT. Very soon they will activate this dynamite. What will happen? Is everything that JJ and Mikey have created now going to be destroyed? Their only lab is under threat. What will happen now? Soon we will know how Mikey and JJ will react to the fact that their house is mined. Maybe they've already made a cure? Mikey, our medication is almost finished. There's a little left and the machine will finish its work. I say while we wait, let's build some armor for our dog. Yep. Thank you, Mikey. I'll go build armor for our dog. Wanna see? No, I think it would be better if, like the last time I stayed here and looked after the situation, in case something happened and I called you. Okay, Mikey, then I'm going to build dog armor by myself. I hope this doesn't take too long. I'm glad that Mikey and I have managed to create a cure together. Right now, in our lab, there is a device that works on the potion. When it's done, this potion will help us start treating all the zombie girls. The cool thing is that people don't lose their memories. The zombie girls will become human again and our village will be saved. It was not difficult. I thought the zombie girls were gonna get in our way. I'll finish this armor and come back to you. Bam! Just look how cool it looks. Okay, it's time to check on the device. I think the cure should be ready by now. Hmm. Wow, our dog is cooler. In armor, it can fear nothing. How is our medicine? It's all ready. Now we will definitely save all the villagers and this horror will end. Zombie girls are about to launch dynamite. Get ready, JJ and Mikey. Horror is just beginning. What was that? My God, the zombie girls have returned and destroyed our home. Oh no, she's coming to us. The dog cannot move after the explosion. She's trying to lift us up. Oh, JJ. 
They took us to some cage. We can't even get out of here with a teleport. The holes in the bars are too small for our dog. Zombie girl, let us go. Oh, they won't even understand us. Mikey, we need to figure out a way to get out of this cage. We need to make some improvements for our dog. I've got it. Huh? We've got to build a drill. Oh. Mikey, we need to build this drill in our dog's mouth so we can destroy the grate and escape this prison. If you still have iron blocks, give them to me now. I already have an idea how to build this drill. I think it will work. Hmm. Yes, I have some iron blocks left. I hope that will be enough here. Then start building that drill and I'll get out of your way. Thank you, Mikey. I'll start building right away. I need to finish quickly before the zombie girls come back to us. Hmm, I wonder why they locked us in a cage. Well, it doesn't matter. The most important thing is that we made the potion and took it. It would be terrible if they blew up our house before we finished with the potion. I'm almost done with the drill. It turns out to be incredibly cool. The potion we made, we only have to throw one zombie girl. Then she'll turn into a normal person and all the other zombies will turn into normal people too. But to do that, you have to get out of the cage first. I hope this place isn't guarded by too many zombie girls. I'm done. It's time to get out of this cage. Wow, you look at this drill. Now we're gonna check it out. Wow, just in a flash. Great, we can leave this cage. Hmm, although no. Before we go, I want to quickly check the other cells in this prison. See if we can find someone else. Hmm. There is no one here. It looks like every cell will be empty. Strange. Why we were put in a cage? There is no one here. Okay. We checked. And now we can safely leave this place and go cure a zombie girl. Woohoo! I hope this works. Of course it will work, Mikey. I'm sure of it. We just need to find a zombie girl. Look, here's one of them. Well, now we're going to cure her. Ah! Hmm. Wow, you cured me. Thank you very much. <laughs> Great, Mikey. We did it. If we cured her, then all the other zombie girls turn back into normal people too. We have saved the village. I'm so glad. It's time to leave the dog. Are you ready, JJ? Yeah, Mikey. Let's do it. We just have to jump out. Wow! Mikey, today was incredibly difficult, but we did it! Yep! We saved an entire village! Woohoo! It's time to go home and rest! Bye!